As we've been telling you, it is Election Day. It's Election Tuesday, and we are following more than 400 races and issues. One thing that voters in St. Louis County will be voting on today is Prop M, as in marijuana. Our Alex Fees is live for us at a polling place in Webster Groves with the details. Alex? Michelle Rennie, good morning. You know, it was back in Missouri, back in November, make that, that Missouri voters approved the legalized use of marijuana in the state. Now on this election day, the question becomes, what level of government is going to benefit from marijuana tax revenue? Now, Missouri voters approved Constitutional Amendment 3, which legalized the use and recreational sale of marijuana to those 21 and older. The amendment also placed a 6% state sales tax on purchases and authorized local governments to add a 3% sales tax. In St. Louis County, officials estimate that Prop M on the ballot today would bring in about $3.5 million in revenue each year. Voters in other counties in the St. Louis area are being asked to consider a tax on recreational marijuana sales as well. In St. Charles County, it is called Proposition 3, and in the city of St. Louis, it is simply called Proposition. Voting for the tax on recreational marijuana, and I would hope that other people would do that too. It will go to county services that we need to provide. Most of our general revenue funds go to public safety. In its first weekend back in February, recreational marijuana sales in Missouri totaled eight and a half million dollars. Now polling places in Missouri and Illinois today open up at six o'clock and they'll be uh, open until seven o'clock tonight. Coming up starting at 530, I'll take a look at the St. Louis Board of Aldermen races in South City. Live this morning in Webster Groves, Alex Fees, Five on Your Side.